how is it going everybody i hope you're having a wonderful day today's video is about this not the key but the key fob itself and how it can help you Now we've all done it. We went to the big box stores like the Walmarts or the Lowe's or the Home Depots. And on a cra any crowded day of the year, you know, you, you go in, you get what you want, you come back out, and you're like, where's my car? Where the world did I park? Oh my goodness. This sucks. And that is where this comes into play. If you're close enough, you can hit the button twice, right? The first time, the lights will blink. Second time the horn will blow. Horn will blow. Okay. But that is only if you're so close. After you get so far away, you know, like this is like one or two aisles over. Once you get so far away, it doesn't work. But I'm going to show you how to do it and science is going to help, believe it or not. Now I'm only going to walk a short distance, right? Stop and try it. As you can see, it's still working walk a little farther or further depending on what part of the country you're from and what side of the river you're from <laughs> and i'm just going to keep doing this until we find where it won't work still working do da do da as you can see we got more rain coming yay imagine that more rain <laughs> all right let's stop we have now doubled the distance this is like two rows still works so let's back her on back up. Do 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 do. And no, all those donuts on the road was not me. That was these guys up here with these four wheelers. Let's see, we're pretty good distance. Let's say, still works. I hope I got enough room on this road to demonstrate this. Cross over on this side. As you can see, it's not working. I'm pushing the button, not working, right? Here's where science is going to actually help you. If you have anything that has liquid in it, right? And I don't know what it is. It's something about the frequency that comes out of this is magnified by the water. We'll make that work. Let's see if it works. Look at that. See it? Crazy, isn't it? And if I do it without it, it doesn't work. But I know, you come out of a store, a lot of times you might not have a glass of water, a bottle of water. It can be a soft drink, anything that's liquid filled. But let's just say you went in the store and didn't buy anything, right? It happens, I've done it. Well, guess what your head's full of? Your head is full of liquid water, right? So watch this. Pretty crazy, isn't it? Let me get over on this side just in case I'm blocking it. Without. With. <laughs> I just wanted to give you this tip because I know we've all done it. We've all been in that spot. We've all went to stores and come out and like, where is my car? Been there, done that. Now it gets worse with age, let me tell you. But I just wanted to put this tip out there for you. So if you, you know, not all key fobs are created equal some of the higher end cars have a lot longer range than this and everything or your batteries might be worn like i've never replaced the battery in this so i know it's worn so the distances might be different but if you're ever in a situation let me start walking back to the car if you're ever in a situation where you come out of a store and you don't know where your car is your remote and science can help you find it it will greatly increase the distance now all you have to do is be within hearing distance of your horn right so if you have to hit the emergency button on there and the little red button makes your alarm go up 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 i guarantee you you'll hear that but until next time you guys get out there and take care and i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching